Hey guys, I'm Randy Weaver. I own Weaver Customs here in West Jordan, Utah. And what you're looking at behind me is a 1970 Sports Satellite. Let me walk you through it, tell you everything we've done to it. So what we started with was a stock bodied 1970 Sports Satellite. And the gentleman that owns this car has owned it since 1973. So he's had it quite a while. What we did is we did all our crazy metal fabrication, as you can see, the lower rockers, the valances, these live ducks here. This hood up here is just insane. It took me, I don't know how many hours in this thing to, it's pretty much a, a, a whole remade hood. All custom hood scoop here. Tried to follow after the um, iconic old muscle car hood and then made it functional for the Hellcat supercharger. Live ducks here as well. And we could pop these up. We got one on each side so they mirror each other. So when you pop this hood open, you have your air filter here and you have your intercooler here. So this is the heat exchanger for your, you know, your Hellcat uh, supercharger. This little motor made right at 900 horse backed by a six speed transmission. Sitting on Scott's Hot Rods IFS, narrowed nine inch forward in the rear with triangulated four link with a crazy Watts link pan hard bar. Uh, big Wheelwood disc brakes like our typical fashion. And then custom three piece EVOD wheels, 20 by 15s in the rear, 18 by eights up front. So what we did up front here is we wanted to keep the muscle car look, but yet a really modern look as well. So I went through, made this all out of 18 gauge sheet metal. So this front chin splitter is all 18 gauge and live ducting as well. So I try to make everything live, as well as like these brake ducts, those are fully functional. Handmade the front bumpers as well, just like the rear bumper, so nothing was left untouched. And we come back to the back here, we handmade all these bumpers, redid all the tail fins, made this cool little wing back here, flush fit the tail light, remade the whole back tail pan, made a killer roll pan underneath because we want to do a little bit of supercar styling. So we just try to make it modern and neat. So in the interior, I can open this door and let you see. It's trimmed in Hyde's leather, trimmed by JNS Custom Interiors. And you look in here and you see a killer one-off billet shifter that replicates the old pistol grip shifter, which is cool. Billet specialty D-shaped steering wheel, really killer Dakota digital gauges. Just everything to make this thing a real comfortable car going down the road, but yet have a lot of muscle. Another really important thing in all of our builds is fit and finish. We make sure all our panel fitment is awesome. Everything flows, so there's no inconsistency when you look down the body of this car. And other than that, that's about it. Thanks for checking this out. I hope you enjoyed it and have a good one.